Hey everyone, how's it going today? I just been to the junkyard and I picked up a couple of stuff. Not all of it is here, it's a lot of it's in the other car, but I've got a bunch of stuff and today I'm going to be replacing the third brake light. What I have done is I have taken one of those old struts to show you guys that two of my LEDs are out. This one and this one. Now, this junkyard third brake light may or may not have all LEDs working, but I figure if it doesn't, it'll still probably have enough LEDs that I could salvage those LEDs and put it into this one. Plus, this doesn't cost me 150 frickin' dollars, but only about 20. So let's install it. Okay, let me show you how this works here. You pull, oops, let me get a little camera angle here. You pull this tab, and the seat comes out. Well, it comes down, anyways. Let me get myself comfortably situated here. I will put the third brake light here. All right. I'm in the back of the car now. I apologize for the low light. I put these seats down and I have popped this part off. It's a little push pin, okay? And now I need to get it out from these corners. And to do that, I need to remove these leather things. And these leather things, um, I found that I could pull mine back, but you might have to push down on like a little metal tab in there. I don't know if you can see it. There's a metal tab and you just push down and whatever. And this is also bolted down, and this is a 10 millimeter bolt. I have found a wrench. I'm going to try my best to do this one-handed with a light source as possible. If it doesn't come out right, I apologize, but I shall attempt to do it. And let me just set this aside somewhere where I won't lose it. Um, I wouldn't lose it in the cup holder, I hope. So now I will just remove this part. Let's see if I can shine some light on the situation. Left hand light greystone. Chrysler... Torino left hand bolster. VIN number 5H, whatever. Uh, yeah, so I take this out. Here's that little metal tab I was talking about that seems to go here into this hole. And there's that bolt. So now I removed this piece. I will remove uh, that piece. Righty tidy, lefty loosey. Go back in the cup holder. Don't need this wrench no more. Might as well pick this bracket from this one because it fell out me as I tried tinkering with it earlier. Uh, just edge this up, push this off. Okay, now I had, like I said, I popped this piece off earlier. Now we need to take it out from that corner and this corner. So what we do now is bend this plastic out. Stay in there, damned bracket. Pull this out like so. Okay, same thing here, though this one is stuck in really good, but pull it out all the same. Oh, there's a push pin in there, is that why? Too bad, that's coming out. And pull. You will notice that this is now coming off. 
You just have to finesse it just a little bit. I'm going to have to put the camera down for a second, guys. But what I'm going to do is I'm just going to try to pull this out from this. Okay, I got it. There's the other side. So just pull it and that's this. I want to keep it because it's original. Equipment bra, panel assembly, rear shelf upper. That's going to come in use. So I'm just going to leave it. Just in case I need this part for whatever reason, I'm going to know what it's called. <sighs> Yep, just dump that behind me back there somewhere. And now we have the brake light. Unplug it. Boom. And at this point, just because I got mine from a junkyard, I'm going to plug mine in and I'm going to hit the brakes. Um, just to be sure that, you know, before I continue, if mine even works. So I'm just going to take this and plug it in, okay? Can I set the camera down without it falling? Maybe. 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 Alright, just a quick test. This thing cost like 20 or 30 dollars. If it doesn't work, I can't be mad. But if it works, that would be lovely. Oh my god, perfect, wonderful. I have a fully functioning brake light assembly. All right, now I just have to undo that one and put this one in. Perfect, I just, one of these cost 150 to 180 dollars. And I pulled this one out of the junkyard for like 20 or 30. It feels amazing. Take my shoes off, climb back into the car, and get working. Let me just unplug this again. Okay, eight millimeters, too big. Six millimeters, too small. I do not have, or I can't, I just too lazy to really look for or find a seven millimeter. So what I'm doing is I'm using an adjustable. A profoundly huge adjustable. Okay. I just want to see if I could break them loose. They do have a Phillips head screwdriver thing on top, but I have no clue how I'm going to fit a flat fucking screwdriver in there. Still not loose. So, with the adjustable, I work away being careful not to hit the glass or anything like that. Fun, fun. There. Progress. More progress, more progress, even more progress, 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 aha, yeah, so, phone, please phone, yeah, so as I was saying, this has a, like a Phillips, but like I said, I can't stick a screwdriver there. Just one more to go on that side, and then we yank this sucker out. Let me just put this somewhere where I won't lose it, aka the cup holder. Everybody wants to be a YouTube certified mechanic these days. Righty tidy, lefty loosey, seven millimeter thing. Progress, progress. Congress. <laughs> Progress. <laughs> I made a political joke. Progress. 
Thank God. Get in there, you son of a bitch. Okay, how do I yank this son of a bitch out? Think for a second here. Okay, so what I just did was I said fuck it and I just pulled it out. Let's see if I could recreate that real quick. That was actually pretty funny. Where does this go? Let me this. Jump in there. Yeah, so what I was just, I was just like, fuck this. And I had pulled it out. Now, uh, this glass is a little bit grimy, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to clean up the glass before I install the new third brake light. So I'm going to put this here in the trunk. So I don't get mixed up between the two and put the old one back in, okay? And let me get a paper towel and clean up that glass just a little bit. That light bulb is very hot, by the way. Ah! Burned myself on it again. Ah, it's cleany, 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 clean. A little bit of water, but then immediately follow it up with a dry clean enough new one is going in okay so if I can be all fuck it with that one I can be all fuck it with this one I hope bum, bum, bum. Ah. in and she's in Cruise. Anyways, installation is reverse of removal. So, I'm going to just put this in this hole. This and this hole. And just tighten them down. I'm not going to make them hulk tight. Fuck that. That's on solidly. Now I take this, and I plug it in, <clears throat> like so. Alright, this little piece of paper, um, I'll just put that back here. Okay, as I was saying, installation is reverse of removal. So, the next thing to go on will be this whole rear shelf thingy. So I'm going to have to put my camera down for that as I try to finesse my way around it. progress okay there's a little hook underneath I'll try and show you actually I don't know but there's a hook underneath and I'm gonna try to make this hook latch in to the that hook latch in to that thing I'm gonna put this back into where it lives. Here's a hole for that. Pop that in good. Everything is aligned and tip top. Close this neatly. Close this neatly. Close this neatly. Pop this back into place. Dumb son of a. Pop this back into place. This bracket lives like that okay and Now it's going to be a game with the lighting again, since I can't find a nice place to put my damn phone. But, I will try, okay? 
there is this little thing here that goes in here, and then this bolts into there. Okay? Like I said, just the reverse. I think that's tight enough. Now the other one. And that should be solid. Should be. Should be. All right. Let me take the garbage. My CDs. My hella cool CDs. They need to be in position. And moment of truth. That goes in. And that goes in. Voila! And that's it. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful and informative, please like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.